If Wisconsin is well known for anything, it's got to be for our award-winning cheese. So he challenged three talented chefs to each use one type of cheese and make three very different dishes. First up is Nathan Berg, head chef of the Lakely restaurant at the Oxbow Hotel in Eau Claire. We challenged him to use Cameroon Gouda from Comstock Creamery. I've been a chef for a long time and working with a lot of these local cheeses from Wisconsin. I've been to most of the cheese factories around the state and then uh, obviously you know I get to see it to the to the end result where it actually hits somebody's mouth but I figure that's the perfect thing for a chef to geek out about when you really want to showcase Wisconsin. Next we challenge Luke Zahm, chef at the Driftless Cafe in Viroqua, to create three different dishes using Car Valley's Penta Creme Blue Cheese. I want you to experience the, the rapture that is the Wisconsin cheese making industry when you come to the cafe. We're trying to distill out the best cheeses so when people come in here from the outside, they're blown away. I literally have to do nothing to make that experience wonderful. Last but certainly not least is Adam Siegel, executive chef at the Lake Park Bistro in Milwaukee, who is able to make three stellar plates using Joe Widmer's Brick Cheese and Brick Cheese Spread. I do love the fact that Wisconsin cheeses have come such a long way, but there are also a lot of Wisconsin cheeses that have been here for so long that it's fun to work with those staples that have been here for a long time, and Widmer's Brick is one of them. Not only is Wisconsin cheese the best, it's also incredibly diverse in the many different ways to enjoy it. And no matter how you use it, there's no wrong way to hit a Wisconsin cheese trifecta.